Hello everyone. So welcome to another video. In the last video I showed you guys how to create this simple solar system animation in custom paint. And after that I got some feedback, some questions basically asking that is it possible to create a moon that rotates around the earth. So the answer is yes absolutely and this is kind of like a bonus video to that. So in this video I'm going to show you how to create a moon which revolves around the earth as earth revolves around the sun. So here is our canvas code and as you can see then we have this three draw circle. One for drawing the sun, the another one for drawing the orbit and the third one is for drawing the earth. And now as logic detects we need to add another circle which will be somewhere placed at a distance this much away from earth and also in another circle which will indicate the orbit of the moon so we are going to do just that so before i get into that the first thing i need to do is refactor this code to make it a little bit more understandable so here you can see we have this 200 here here and here and what this basically is is the radius basically the distance between distance from the center of the canvas to the earth so it will be earth orbit radius i'm going to create a constant and i'm going to replace all the 200 with this constant all right so if i not that so if i hold restart again so everything is working perfectly now what we need to do is first of all calculate the x and y position for the moon so before that i also have to define the moon orbit radius and the moon radius as well so it is easier to understand and read the code and i can say moon radius around 15 and these things needs to be double as well all right so let me just add the moon orbit radius fine and similarly i need to calculate the moon y and which should be size dot height by two around the central canvas plus not the earth orbit radius in this case the moon orbit radius and yeah that's fine and this should be sorry this should be y now that we have the position the next thing we need to do is draw the circle canvas top draw circle and for the center i'm going to use this offset that i created moon x comma moon y and for the radius i'm going to pass in the moon radius and for the paint i'm going to copy the sun paint and rename it to moon paint i want the moon to be of the color gray yes all right so if i hold reload again now you can see that we have the moon here which is not where we want our moon to be but we can fix that so the next step we have to do is to make sure that the moon goes along with the earth and as well the moon also rotates the earth so for this we are also going to make use of the trigonometry functions sine and cosine and just like how we multiply the x position with the cos value and the y position with the sine value of the offset for the earth we are going to do the same thing here and in addition we also have to multiply for the moon orbit radius as well so the first thing we need to do is multiply the earth orbit radius with the cosine of animation value and likewise the moon orbit radius with the cosine of animation value and if i outload you can see that and as you can see that the moon is moving 
in the x direction now we have to do the similar thing to the moon y so here we have to multiply with the sign of animation value so i have to multiply moon orbit radius with the sign of animation value and if i hold reload now you can see that instead of going in a straight line it is going in an angle to where and i think i made a mistake here yeah i also have to add the earth orbit radius to the moon y position as well and if i hold to load you can now see yes the moon is moving differently and similarly i also have to multiply the earth orbit radius with the sign of animation value as well like how we did for the earth circle and if i hold load again now you can see the moon is moving along with the earth but this is still not the desired animation right we want the moon to go along with the earth but at the same time we want the moon to orbit the earth as well if we multiply this with any other number like 2 and hot load now you can see moon is moving just not in a circular orbit way and if i do it for the y as well now you can see that the moon is moving around earth and its speed is yep so when you when you remove the earth right what is happening is the moon is going on a helical orbit you can say if you visualize the kind of part that is being drawn by the moon you can kind of imagine that it is going like a spiral way which is exactly what it looks like from a stationary reference point and if you see and if you kind of visualize to remove the earth so uh, to make this better we can do a couple of things let's reduce the radius of the moon to 10 to make a little bit more smaller and also increase the moon radius to 40 so that it is a little bit more further away and i can also zoom as well because i have wrapped my widget custom pane with interactive viewer in the last video so it is looking good let's try multiplying this with a different value for example something like 6 and if i hold reload now it is looking more like an animation all right so um, i do want to change the color of the moon so gray dot shade 200 something maybe a little bit less than that okay let's try to change the background color the colors dot black okay now it is looking more perfect and now if you want to add the moon orbits around the earth as well we can do the same thing just like drawing this earth orbits around the sun we can say canvas dot draw circle and for the center we can pass in the center we have passed for the moon like size of it by 2 plus earth or pitch radius plus moon or pitch radius we don't need the n multiplication of course any for the moon or pitch radius in this case so you can say offset of x and for the orbit of the moon we can also copy the same position from the moon y minus the sign animation multiplication for the moon orbit radius and for the radius we can say i have already defined a constant here we can reuse it and for the moon orbit pane we can reuse the orbit pane that we used to draw the earth orbit and if i hold alone now you can see then this is known what exactly we want 
let's see what i did wrong here so we are multiplying the width we are taking the moon x position in moon y the orbit is staying with the earth so the problem is its position it, um, because orbit is also a circle with the you can imagine that the center of the orbit is staying exactly at the position where the moon is orbiting so i think i found the mistake instead of adding the moon orbit radius here we don't need anything extra so if i hold load yeah now it is working so this is how you can draw a moon orbit as well and this is how you can animate the moon position around the earth and making sure that the moon and the orbit sticks to the earth as it moves around the sun so thanks for watching and as always the source code for this code will be provided in the description and if you want to see more videos like this then do let me know by liking this video and also subscribing to my channel this will encourage me to put up more videos in a more frequent way and in the next part of the series i'll be drawing the other planets as well using the similar approach and in that video i'll be completely making the end solar system which will be an add-on to this video as well. So stay tuned.